Hey guys, Nova Explosion. Welcome back to more Final Fantasy X-2, the post game. So it's been a while since I've recorded. I apologize for that. Klonoa Fantasy Reverie came out. I have been uploading that. I don't even think uh, part 121 hasn't gone live. Part 120 went live where we got the amazing Chocobo. But part 121 hasn't yet, but that'll be up on YouTube shortly once Klonoa and Crash 3 are done uploading. Probably more when Klonoa's done, I'll upload that part 121. But anyway, I'm back. As you can see, I have the Flame Dragon here. I was working on getting some of the Aeons. The reason why is because I made a big mistake when I was doing this post game. I should have been doing the Aeons like when Yuna, Riku, and Pain were lower level. But since they're like in the, the 70s, I have taken the long way. And I have to basically level up the Aeons a certain amount to get their Fiend Fragments and make them turn... Or not the Aeons, but the monsters and turn them to aeons so i apologize for that but uh i just figured you know what i'm gonna show you all which monsters become what i'm gonna do the grinding off screen it makes my life easier because like it's really boring to watch me grind um and also the main reason why i'm doing this is you might notice why i only have some of the monsters i have gipple nuge and barrel eye so i cannot fit all the aeons on my team even if i didn't have gipple nuge and barrel eye i think i would be short one aeon so I can't have all the Aeons at once. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this part of the video. I'm going to show you all the fiends that turn to the Aeons. And then I'm going to end the, like, end the recording. This is going to be like, I don't know how long this video is going to be. But uh, I'm going to put like pieces of the video. Pieces of like my recording of like showing you guys what fiends become the Aeons. So after all these, it's going to skip to the next batch of Aeons I get, or the not, yeah, the next batch of Aeons, but I'm going to have to grind in between this and the next recording, so. For now, uh, I have to stream in like five minutes, so this shouldn't take very long, but we are going to, um, I'm going to release these four. I could have fit one more, but honestly, I have to, I think there's nine Aeons, so I figured why not. But uh, let's uh, release all these uh, fiends and see what they become. So basically, you have to get them up. I don't think it's a specific level. I think you have to get them up like three to five levels somewhere in that range. Just level up the fiends and uh, wait until this message procs, which is the fiend has a faith fragment. So now we can release Flam Blanco, and I will let you guys either figure out or see who becomes what. As you can see, they're all going to turn to Aeons here, which is kind of neat, honestly. A neat way to do the Aeon Cup. There's Shiva. Classic. Who else would Flam Blanco become? So now Shiva is available in the Battle Simulator to fight. I'm going to fight. Actually, that's probably what I'll do. I'll probably show you all releasing the Fiends and getting the Aeons to come out. And then in that same video, I'll probably fight all the Aeons just to show you their battles. Yeah, so the Aeon Shiva has entered the Fiend Arena. So we're not going to fight Shiva right now. I'm honest. Ooh, I actually need a large pod because I need to get more creatures for the other Fiends. We're not going to fight Shiva right now. We're not going to fight any Aeon until I have them all. That's how I'm going to do this. Now let's see what happens when we release Mycotoxin. This one might not be as obvious. It's my boy Valifor. Classic OG. So yeah, this is a really cool way to get the Aeons. Like have a fiend become an Aeon. It's kind of neat. I really like it. It's really, it's a really interesting way to do it. Critical bug. The, the last one we have, the Flame Dragon, might be kind of obvious. Like, Flam Blanco, like, who else would it become? Flame Dragon might also be obvious, but in case you don't know, I'll keep it a secret until we release it. It's your Jimbo. By the way, uh, I'm at 20 decibels with Hen 2. I don't know if that's too loud for the game. It should be fine, though. I just did some mic tweaking because, uh, still getting used to this new mic and working out the noise gate, especially for when the construction is done. 
I'm probably gonna need to like edit some audio stuff because like it's gonna be a new living arrangement sort of Finally the flame dragon So that's what we got Shiva Balafor Yojimbo Ifri that should leave us with Ixion Magus sisters Bahamut Am I forgetting one? Yeah, this is Ifri. This is a uh, this is the one I was like, hey, it's kind of obvious. So we're missing Ixion, Magus Sisters, Bahamut, and there might be one more I can't think of right now. Ixion, Bahamut, and uh... So that's all of them. That's all the ones I have now. I have five more spaces. I think five more spaces is exactly how many more I need. Let me actually double check right now while I have you guys. Again, this isn't a full video. This is like a part of a video. But let me see. FF10 to Aeon Cup. Alright, so we got Valifor, Shiva, Ifri, and Yojimbo. We need Bahamut. Oh, there's only four. Okay. Oh, Anima. I forgot Anima. Okay, yeah, we, we have enough space. So, uh, yeah, I could have got the extra one today, but then we would have needed three regardless. So, regardless, I need to get a second batch of Aeons. But now that I did this, I can do that off screen. I'll probably do that after I stream today. I'll start working on that, and I'll get the other half recorded. I'm going to get started on 10 post postgame. I apologize for it taking so long, but, you know, Klonoa came out, and then, like, Three Hopes is still really, really good. I'm trying to play a lot of that, but I am going to do 10 2 I also have another thing planned for Final Fantasy. I have something else planned, but 10 2s first. Once 10 2s post game is done, I'll do uh, the other thing I'm planning. But yeah, I will see you all. Well, it's the same video, but I will see you all in the next recording when I get Bahamut, Maga Sisters, Anima, and Ixion. See you all then. Alright, I am back. I have gotten the remaining monsters we need. So I have the Aranae. The Azita Haka, a Jumbo Cactuar, and then Machina Striker. These will get us the last four Aeons that we need. So let's go do that really quick. And I don't know what we're going to do after that. We can either go do Gunner's Gauntlet. I know we can also start via Infinito. We'll probably go do Gunner's Gauntlet because I feel like that's been on the back burner for a hot minute. So let's just release these fiends and get them. I also want to fight the Aeons, so we'll probably fight the Aeons first, actually. After that, we'll kind of figure out what to do. But Machina Striker, you could probably guess what this uh, mm, uh, fiend will get us. I almost said monster, which wouldn't have been incorrect, but I'd rather use the correct terminology. But it's Ixion, in case you couldn't figure it out. So here is Ixion. So now Ixion's available in the fiend arena. I sure hope 20 decibels isn't too loud for FF10 too. I forget every time. I'll take the trap pod L. Why not? There's Ixion. We have now Jumbo Cactuar. Let's see. This one might be a little harder to figure out on what it gets us. Here are the Magus Sisters. So we now have them on the Aeon Cup. I'm probably going to wait a bit to fight them, actually. I think I want to fight them in the Aeon Cup, or I'll just do it later. So I did say I would show off the Aeons, but these are getting the Aeons, and I'll probably wait a bit to, uh, to, uh, fight them. I do think after this, I'm going to probably, we'll probably go do Gunner's Gauntlet, to be honest. And then, uh, maybe start the Infinito after that. I'm trying to think what's left in the playthrough. We got Via Infinito. We got Gunner's Gauntlet. I don't know about the Calm Lands. I was trying to grind up publicity points, but it is so tedious. Because I talked to everyone and I'm at 355. This is Anima. We got Anima here. It's just so annoying to grind publicity in this game. Because I have to, like, play the mini games and I get, like, one point per, like, victory. So it's insanely tedious. But I don't know what's going to happen with that. I honestly am considering just like, I don't know, doing all the Fiend Arena and Via Infinito stuff. 
And then, I'm honestly, and the experiment, we still have to fight the experiment and get that trophy unlocked. But I'm honestly considering, like, NG plusing the game. It would mean I would have to replay the game from beginning to end on NG plus to get 100%. It would actually, like, it wouldn't delay the playthrough that much, though, because I have a backlog for this, uh, for these videos. I think part 121 hasn't gone live yet. Part 120 is the last part that went live. But, um, so I could do that. I could just make it, like, here's Bahamut. I could just make it, like, I could, like, do all of Via Infinito and do all the Fiend Arena stuff. NG plus the game, show off the 100% ending. The only things that wouldn't be shown off were, like, the episode completes, but, like, I just feel like the Cronlands episode complete is legitimately really bad and really annoying, so... Either way, I really want to show off the 100% ending no matter what, and I would like to do all of Via Infinito. If Via Infinito starts to annoy me, though... And yeah, there's the Aeon Cup. It's available for uh, doing it, so we'll just do the Aeon Cup as soon as we uh, get strong enough. So there you go. Every single fiend has been unlocked. I know for the far plane cup, or er, there's a certain cup you have to do a little bit more for, like leveling up. So maybe I'll want to do that first. I don't know. But for now, we are going to go do the uh, the uh, gunner's gauntlet. Let's go take care of that and be safe. Because I'm trying to think. I know the far plane cup, you have to like catch a line of monsters. So I'm trying to think here. Do Gunner's Gauntlet. Maybe do up the Cloister 40 of Via Infinito. But then I don't want to go too far because then I have to level up uh, Yuna, Riku, and Pain more. And I don't want to be like, hey, I have to level them up a lot. So I don't know. Either way, let's do Gunner's Gauntlet because I have a little bit of time to record. And we should get Gunner's Gauntlet done. I am really rusty. I have not played in a hot minute. Let's see if I can get 2,800. Alright, I remember the controls. That's good. I'm gonna come back for that chest later. Alright, hopefully the enemy spawn here is, like, really good. Because I need to, like, farm up. Nice, nice. I honestly just keep going. Something's gonna come at me. Yup. Right there, I knew it was gonna come out. I remember that from the other rank. Dead. Now it's your turn to die. It's a chest. No chest for that uh Veruda? That's really annoying. I am so rusty, so I might not get this the first attempt. This might take a while. If it does, it does. That's just how Gunner's Gauntlet goes. I don't know how I'm gonna do this though. My time is really short and I need 2,800. I got 2,000, so I'm kind of hoping this pathway makes it a little easier. And there are all the chests. To. Oh, we had the volleys, right? Oh, and that, uh, the rapid fire thing. Yeah, 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 okay. It's all coming back to me. I might not get it this time because I'm really rusty. I haven't played 10 2. Oh, and the crafting. How'd you do the crafting? It was triangle, I think. Yeah, okay, triangle. There we go. Yeah, I'm not expecting to win this, like, right away, because I have to, like, refresh myself. Nice. If I can get some more regular ammo to get more dual shot, that'd be pog. Nice. Alright. I don't know if I want to, uh... Use that into death because I want to save my dual shots. I'll need it. That one's dead. Keep on going. Keep on going. Time is what I'm really worried about, though. Oh, dang it. That was close. Too close for comfort chest definitely a volley situation actually is it though the 
dang it, no! I moved up on instinct. Yeah, I am, uh, very rusty. I'm not expecting to get this the first try. I'm expecting to fail a couple of times. I need more regular ammo. So I can get, um... More dual shots. I'm short on dual shots. Alright. There we go. Time, I feel like, is the biggest factor here, to be honest. I feel like time and, like, getting the chest and stuff, that's going to be the big factor here, I feel. go that's good get some more dual shots we'll need it this is insane dude i'm barely advancing i'm still at this early part of the road i messed that up something fierce Okay. I'm gonna have to start throwing out volleys. You get points for using volley, don't you? I think you do. Nice. Are using all these deaths? I don't think I used a volley there. I couldn't tell. I hope I didn't. If I get this first try, that'd be insane. I'd be surprised if I did. Volley situation. Nice. Grab all this. I got more volleys. Nice. All right. Is it a death situation? Honestly, yeah. Dang it. That was a bad volley opportunity. Maybe if I didn't get hit, I would have this. Probably. Spam volley and hope for the best, I guess. Okay, I somehow turned that around. I need more volleys, please. Aw, oh, dang it. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get this one. Definitely not. I kind of knew that going in. I knew I wasn't gonna get it first try. Yeah, yeah, this, this is a no-go. Alright, I think I have the gist of what I'm supposed to do. Probably. We'll see if I can get it the second attempt. Our right, time run out. Come on, I'm waiting for the time to run out. Perfect, all right. Let's try this again. Let's see if I can do this. All right, chat. So I was trying Gunner's Gauntlet a little bit and I got a little salty during it. I'm, I'm not going to do it right now. So I think this is going to be a little shorter video. I just wanted to show you how to get the Aeons. And now we have the Aeon Cup unlocked. So, I'm honestly just going to end it here. I didn't want the video to end on the cliffhanger. So, when we come back next time, we will probably start Via Infinito, I think. I think, honestly, I'm just going to do Via Infinito. I still want to fight the experiment. And uh, I want to do Via Infinito, fight, go through all of Via Infinito if I could. Then do the cups. And then I really want to just get the 100% ending. Like, I might just have to replay the game. So, there might be a bit of a hiatus in some of these videos at some point. But I promise you promise you promise you i will get this playthrough like complete i will at least show the 100 ending i'm not sure if I'll, sh I'll do the i'll try the cups we'll see how they actually go 
And I'm not sure if we'll do all of the Infinity though, but I promise you I will show off the 100% ending and I'll give this playthrough a decent, like a good enough conclusion, you know? So I will, we'll do more with this playthrough. I don't know how much though, because like my times, it's really crunch and I just tend to use post games like really iffy sometimes. So I will definitely, without a doubt, I will try the Infinito. We'll see how far we get. We'll probably do at least Cloisters 40 and 60 because I know up to 60 I did in my original playthrough and my other playthroughs. I know 80 and 100 could be rough. So we'll see if I'm able to like if, if they're annoying or not. And I would like to do Gunner's Gauntlet level 9 still. So we'll, we'll do more with the playthrough. I don't know exactly like what I'm going to do. I do have another thing planned for Final Fantasy that I'm going to kind of continue. So maybe I'll take that place or maybe I'll keep this in the hiatus. I don't know what's going to happen. But basically, I will do more with the game and I will let you all know when it's done. I'll definitely show off the 100% ending, but I might need to replay the game. So, but yeah. Those of you watching, hope you all enjoyed. When we come back next time, we will... Uh, oh, and the mascot dress sphere. I want to make sure we get the mascot dress sphere. That's something I have to make sure we do as well. But yeah, uh, those of you watching, hope you all enjoyed. Uh, we will probably... I don't know what's going to happen next. Maybe I'll do level 9 Gunner's Gauntlet. Maybe I'll start going through via Infinito. I'll do something. I'll do something. But uh, I'll be back with this uh, as soon as I could, I promise. But yeah, thank you all for watching. See you all next time.